welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a very exciting video. Oh my goodness. I was so happy to receive this PR box from Kaleidos containing their new highlighter collection. How gorgeous is this? So they came out with six new highlighters and I have them all here. I want to do a swatch party video. I'm going to do face swatches of these highlighters. Now I haven't done a face swatch video. I don't think ever for anything but since they sent these to me I figured that I should definitely take advantage I mean when do I ever get a whole collection of anything and they sent me all of them and I haven't really seen a lot of tan girl swatches so if you're excited and if you want to see what these look like on my skin tone just keep watching okay so I did bring you guys in a little bit closer and Teddy Oh my goodness. Here's Teddy, guys. He is in his Christmas sweater. I got this at Target. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you haven't seen Teddy's style. I actually watched my 2018 favorites video, and I realized that I haven't really had him in videos very often this year. But that's because if I have him in videos, I get sidetracked. So I hope you guys enjoy seeing him. I'm going to try and put him back down again and see if he quietly sits there, which never usually happens. Anyway, zoomed you guys in. I already filmed this eyeshadow look. It's the one I created with the Morphe Holiday Palette. So if you haven't already seen it, it's somewhere in my channel archives. So I'm wearing this shade already on my face. This is Space Age in Star Surfer. This is what it looks like in the packaging. This packaging is so cute. I have never seen a highlighter in like a tin packaging, I don't think. So there is what that shade looks like and here it is on my cheeks. I'm just gonna build it up a tish bit more just so you guys can see the color. But these are gorgeous and I honestly really, really just wanna use them as inner corner highlights. But this I have on my chin a little bit. Actually, I ate wings so I did. <laughs> rub off some of my highlighter. I had it on my upper lip, on my nose, as well as around here. So that is the first shade and here is a hand swatch of it. It is called Space Age in Star Surfer. So this is the shade Comet Catcher. Sorry, my mirror is here, the one I used to do my, oh, this is pretty, to do my makeup and it has its own like light so it turns on <laughs> when it's motion activated. Anyway, this is Comet Catcher from Kaleidos and I'm gonna swatch that on my cheeks. I'm just gonna do this side because the light really hits it so you guys can really see the color. So I will swatch it for you now. Okay guys, so I did just like blend some foundation onto my cheek. So I'm gonna go ahead with Space Age in Comet Catcher. And this is just my Real Techniques highlighting brush. And I'm just gonna throw that onto my cheek. This one is also a pinky highlight, but it has a more pink base, kind of, than the previous shade called Star Surfer. And you can definitely see that in my swatch on my hand as well. So here is the first shade I swatch, and here is the next shade I swatch. As you can tell, there's definitely a difference. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my goodness. I can just build it up some more, so. There is the shade Comet Catcher from Kaleidos. Okay guys, the next shade I wanna swatch is Ray Rider, and it's a beautiful orange color, I'm assuming, based from the packaging. Again, gonna grab my Real Techniques brush, which I cleaned off. We're just gonna go into this one and highlight. Oh my gosh, I didn't even need, <laughs> this is so blinding. I didn't even need a lot of this. Holy moly. It's kind of like the perfect shade for my skin tone, but I would probably use a little bit less, but I did go a little dramatic so you guys can see it. So here is the shade Ray Rider. 
This is a beautiful goldeny shade. Here is what it looks like. I'm gonna grab my Real Techniques brush and show you guys what this one looks like. Ooh, <laughs> can you believe this? I'm like barely, like it's just one dip. So that is the shade Solar Sailor. Okay guys, so I've just been patting foundation on over my swatches. So I have like six layers of foundation on at this point. Heaven help my face. So this is the next shade. This is called Skywalker and it's a beautiful blue highlight. And I definitely don't own anything like this. This one definitely has a little bit more of a glitter, a blue glitter in it or some kind of iridescent for sure. And I'm just watching that. Oh my God. <laughs> Are you guys seeing this? Isn't it so stunning? Wow. <laughs> love, love, love that. I cannot wait to use that as an inner corner highlight. So freaking stunning. And then I'm gonna go into this green shade, which everyone's kind of been like, whoa. I think this is gonna be a beautiful eyeshadow as well. This is the Space H Highlighter in Laser Glazer. I love green so, so much. So I'm gonna swatch this on. Holy crap. Oh yes, queen. <laughs> what? I think this is the one that um, Teresa was like, oh yeah, this one is my alien slut highlighter. Oh shit. <laughs> Do you guys see that? Isn't it so cool? I feel so galactic right now. So that is the last highlighter from Kaleidos. And here is the cute packaging. Oh my gosh, I'm so pumped. And I totally forgot to hand swatch. So let me do that for you quick here as well. Okay guys, so here are the swatches of the shades on my hand, just so you can see them on my skin and see them next to each other. As you can tell, they are absolutely stunning. Look at my fingers, Oh My gosh, I remember when Angie got these and she was like showing them on Instagram. I literally just wanted to die. <laughs> I was like, Please God, I need those highlighters. And I'm so grateful that I was able to receive them in PR. They're stunning, they're so stunning. Oh my goodness. I'm so happy I have these. They're gonna make such good inner corner highlights and for when I'm feeling like a filthy alien slut, I'll be able to wear them on my cheeks too. These definitely aren't like a new concept for colorful highlighters, but I haven't really bought any like blue highlighters or green highlighters recently. I did used to own the ABH Aurora palette, but I almost feel like that palette was a little bit before its time because I wasn't really ready to wear colorful highlighters and wear shades, iridescent shades in my inner corner highlights. So I feel like the Kaleidos highlighters came at the perfect time because now we're ready, or I'm ready. I shouldn't say we are because you guys might you know, have been rocking colorful highlighters this whole time, so this might not be a new thing for you guys, but uh, for me, it definitely is. Anyway, okay guys, so I just wanted to zoom you guys out for the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. Again, thank you to Kaleidos for sending me this PR package and letting me try out their new product. Let me know your thoughts on these highlighters down in the comments, and I will see you guys in my next video soon. Bye guys.